you know, when I write sometimes, it's like, you know, you're looking at a blank page. <laughs> it can be rather difficult. Other times when I'm in the zone, it just goes. Is it similar yeah. when you're writing? Yeah, it, it, the same thing, really. You know, um, you know, you're sitting there and you're like, when I'm sitting there, like you're like staring at a piece of paper and there's nothing on it. You, you know, you wish you could like uh, make the, the magic magic happen. And you're sitting there and you start, in my case, I start noodling the piano or thinking of a rhythm or, or if I think of a rhythm, I'll write a rhythm down or write some, a line down to some, even if it's four notes, something to kind of kick me, to get me started. And then sometimes, um, sometimes it'll happen where I'll say, I'll, I'll sit down and write a whole line. And, and it could be, have no harmony, nothing, doesn't have to be anything. Sometimes I'll sit down and write a harmonic structure and then figure out what, do I, what am I going to do now? But it's, 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 uh, like I can say, I have, uh, as my wife will tell you, I have very little patience with everything except when I'm working. I have an enormous amount of patience. I get crazy, but it's, it's uh, a, a lot of patience figuring something out. So how it's, it's many. How long does it take to write a chart? Oh, man. Uh, sometimes days, sometimes weeks. There's no. You know, uh, you can't compare like when you do the jiggle day, you do it, you get the, the, the assignment the night before, but then you're talking about like a master rhythm part, the master vocal, you know, once in a great while you'll actually write a chart, you know, maybe a couple of months, but no, generally, uh, it could be days and weeks, you know, right now I'm, I'm, you know, starting on some stuff and it's been taking me a week to even get started on something. I mean, just to get, you know, the first four, get into my A, <laughs> get to get to the theme. I'm having trouble. Is that is that the hardest part? Just getting it started. For me, the hardest part is getting started. Yeah, it really is. And then because um, I work, you know, I do long. My scores are in longhand. I don't use computers, so I use a lot of manuscript paper, which is all my sketches. So I write a whole bunch of stuff out. It's the it's it's and it's not the piano. It's the what I'm writing is the band or the orchestra in my head. And then sometimes I'll, I won't do a, a, a sketch from beginning to end. I'll get a certain part of it. Then I'll start orchestrating. I'll go to score paper. And then while I'm sometimes while I'm scoring, I will let it. I'll say, no, I don't like that. I'm going to maybe do the trombones open instead of mutes or something like that. You know, so kind of same with same with if I'm running for orchestra, the same thing will happen. But it's a, I love the process. I, I really love the process of it. You, you're a writer. It's the same process, basically. Yeah, the, you, know. you, have to, you have to dig the process. But I got to ask you, the reason that people use uh, computer software, and I use word processing software, it's very easy to make changes. If you're writing on a chart and you want to change it, isn't it difficult to make some changes? Uh, yeah, you'll see my scores, you'll see a lot of erasure marks, <laughs> a lot of erasers. No, but even guys who have the uh, use computer, they'll say, oh, man, I tried to change this eighth note to a sixteenth, and I had to do this, and I had to do that, and then, then it got done, something fell down, and then my heart, I got to hurt my arm or something. So I'd rather, uh, I'd rather just go with the eraser, and and, uh, and, and you'll see some, some day when we're together, I'll show you some scores with the erasers, you can see some of the, if you get a fine, you know, like a microscope, you see some of the old notes there. Now, I, I prefer that for me. You know, I, I really prefer it. 